Hi hey guys, and welcome back to the channel, Ron's Keto Cafe, and I'm Ron. Well, if you're new, welcome, and if you're a returning member, welcome back. And if you're a new member, could you please consider sharing, liking, and subscribing to my channel. It helps other members know when I post videos. And for all your recent re uh, subscribers, thank you very much for coming along with my journey in my uh, awesome YouTube channel. Well, I'm getting better at the uh, recipe filming, as you can see, and... Uh, What's going on with a lot of this now, I'm using a new program called Filmora 12, and I'm starting to get kind of great at it, and it's getting to be a little bit of a challenge compared to the other program that I use. But it's important to me that I use that program as well as the Premiere uh, and After Effects for the Adobe programs, because uh, I've been telling you guys right along, we're gonna be going back to school starting in September. I went yesterday at the college, and we got all our paperwork squared away, Got my tuition and grant money for my books, and I'm going to be picking up my books next week, and the school starts on September 6th. And it's going to be uh, Monday through Thursday, four days a week, a couple hours uh, each day, maybe uh, it was one, two days where I got to split up the day. It's kind of like it'll be like at 10 o'clock in the morning to 4 o'clock in the afternoon type deal. But, you know, we're going to try it, and if it's too much for me, I'll just back off or I'll just leave. But I, I'm not a, that type of person to quit. And I'm going to go down there next week and pick up my school books. And, uh, yeah, so they gave me uh, quite a bit of money for that. And, uh, you know, just take one day at a time as, as that goes. But the program that I'm going to be taking is called F Film and Video uh, for uh, Productions and Media for what basically what I'm doing now. It's just I've been involved with the uh, Logo Access Station now for the last 10 years or more and putting together video and photography for the city there. I thoroughly know what I'm doing. It's just basically to, to brush up on things that I don't know and help me to advance my education a little further and get a degree out of it. And uh, they gave me a guided tour yesterday and uh, I was really impressed. And we saw the classrooms that I'm gonna be going into and uh, at the uh, studio downstairs in the, in the area where they got it all soundproofed and everything. And, the only thing that I'm not too familiar with is the switchboard and how to use that, but I, I got ideas of how to use that because I was shown at the uh, local studio. But this switchboard that they're using for the uh, sound system is quite sophisticated and, and it's all computerized and it's got a lot of electronic equipment and cameras and computers set up and they, they, they use all the software that I use. So I'm quite familiar with that. So that stuff there will be second nature to me. So it's just figuring out how to work it. So, so it's really nice about it. It's all hands-on experience, and you know, since I already know most of it, it should be a breeze for me. But uh, yeah, we're looking forward to that. And it's, it's going to be a little rough on me. You know, I got to get around my appointments. I got surgery coming up in October. I might wind up pushing that off until I'm done with the semester, and uh, you know, see, you know, just taking it as I can get to it. But I'm going to talk to the teachers about that and ask them advice on what I should do and not. And uh, we're just going to go with the flow. So getting back to the recipes on my videos. Uh, I, I've been really trying to be very careful and uh, the, the deal is we got a lot of apartment noise, street noise, and they got the washroom right adjacent to where I'm sitting. And it, you know, we're constantly uh, screaming at the cat and whatnot. And so I'll be trying to get better by dropping out the background noise and just adding voiceover and music to the video. And uh, my friend Anne Marie there, she made a suggestion for me to try to keep my videos about eight to 10 minutes or 10 minutes, a little bit longer than 10 minutes because once the channel gets monetized, YouTube wants them to release that 10 minutes long. And I didn't know that, so I really appreciate that for uh, suggesting that. And that, that video that I posted with the pumpkin bread recipe, that was actually about a 20 minute video and I was just condensing it down to that length of time. And uh, so I'm gonna try to just definitely get a little bit better with that and keep them a little bit longer, but entertaining as well. And uh, you know, they're gonna get really better. So any other suggestions that anybody out there that can make, that I can make uh, you, you enjoy my channel, let me know and I'll be glad to do that. And if you um, want anything for me to film or if you want me to do something or a project or whatever, you let me know and I'll be happy to do that. I'm gonna be pretty busy with the school and school homework. I'm gonna have to keep up on that because it's very important for me to get good grades. And, um, and I, yeah, again, I'm really looking forward to it. I ha I'm having some issues going on with my left side right now. Is it's the hip. So the hip is uh, hopefully will come out uh, on October 17th if everything goes well with the scheduling. And if not, then I'll push it off a little further. But, uh, yeah, just uh, all I wanted to say. But thank you so much for, um, you know, commenting on the recipe videos. And, like again, uh, you, you know, if there's anything you want me to make, let me know and I'll make it. And be watching for a week um, 158, I believe, update coming up on um, 
Monday and I'm having a good week. I am losing weight this week. I feel pretty good. I'm back on track and we're going to do a carnivore challenge next month and we're going to do carnivore three days a week and do keto the rest of the three days a week and during the carnivore days I'm going to give up coffee and soda. So that's going to be the challenge that I'm going to do. Carnivore is basically easy guys. It's just all meat based diet and uh, you know no fruits, no vegetables and that sort of thing and um, you know you know so that's the way I'm, I'm going to be going. I've done all my research on carnivore, just like I did on the ketogenic lifestyle. And, and you know, again, you do you when you get do your research. You make sure you do your homework, and uh, you'll be fine. But, you know, just trying to eat healthier. Carnivore is going to be a lot easier for me when I go to school because I can pack little lunches and bring them to me for snacks and so I'm not so hungry in between. It's just uh, that's what I'm looking forward to. But uh, again, you hear that noise, yeah, that's street noise. I can't do anything about that. So that's why I, I've been dropping off my initial voice and they can always do a voiceover, you know, when it's quiet, two or three o'clock in the morning, because many mornings I'm up at that hour anyways. But uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed my short little video. Don't forget to get, give me a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Love you guys. Remember, I love you, God love you. Have an amazing day.